Hi, I'm Jeff Dillon with Pure Rockets, and I'm going to give you a, a little tour of the progress on my turbine drone project. So you can see I've built this tower, a test tower, with a counterbalance system built into it, like training wheels. It's got uh, vertical cables that go from the bottom all the way up, and then a uh, counterbalance system connected to the drone. goes up there, you can see two electric winches on either side and then down to the counterbalance weights. And I've got plenty of weights here, enough to counterbalance me. I'm going to go for a ride here pretty soon. Here's the helmet. That's the harness I'll be wearing. Let's go over here. Here's my hero, the flag. So here's, here's where I'm going with this. Here's a scale model of the next prototype. Uses bigger turbines and uh, is human lifting. That's the goal, either for rescue or sport use. So it can either uh, pick up a very heavy payload, several hundred pounds, or without a payload, it can fly very fast. So like this one, it can take off vertically and then transition into horizontal flight. And uh, this one should be able to hit about half the speed of sound. I'm guessing about 350 miles an hour. And you can see the wings on it that uh, will provide the control at that speed. It's got the control surfaces. They're not, the linkage isn't hooked up yet, but it will be. And so with no payload, it should be able to do, go very fast. Commercial application might be for drone defense. And uh, there's a uh, anti-drone measure that it can deploy right there, like a bolo. So let's take a little closer look at the drone itself. So we have three jet turbines. They each provide about 25 pounds of thrust. They're uh, pretty slow on the throttle response, so for steering and balancing, I also have incorporated uh, three electric fans, one there, and one there, and then one over there. And that's what we're testing today. So we're testing this, the flight controller. It's uh, the first time I've used it. It's a flight controller by Earl Robotics, very intelligent platform. And then it's connected through all the maze of cables. And then right there, um, you can see the Rock 7 satellite transceiver. So this drone can be controlled from anywhere in the world. So let's give it a test flight. See how it, see how it looks. Very stable. <laughs> 